Hey guys, welcome to another calculus lesson. Uh, today we're going to talk about a concept called differentiation and uh, we're just going to slightly touch on that subject because it's such a deep topic. Uh, we probably won't get very far on it in one video but you should get some idea of what it means after watching this. Um, so the first thing we did uh, last lesson was um, we learned how to find the gradient at any point on the curve. So if you recall we drew a curve y equals x squared so this is the curve and if we want to know the gradient at a point on the curve what we have to do is draw a tangent line at that point. So for example if we wanted to know the gradient at x is equal to 10 what we want what we had to do was draw a tangent line at that point and then we use the gradient of the tangent line uh, which is the same as the gradient of the curve at that point so you can see that the gradient of the tangent line here is about 20 so the gradient at this point on the curve is 20. Now there's just one problem. Uh, it's quite difficult to draw the tangent line um, when you don't have GeoGebra. Right? So if we don't have this program it would be very difficult to find the gradient at any point on this curve right? because it's almost impossible to draw the tangent line accurately um, visually. So what we need to learn today is an algebraic method algebraic method for um, finding the gradient of any point on the curve. So without drawing the tangent line we can find the gradient at any point on the curve. So how do we do that? Well what we're going to do is use algebra to find what we call the gradient function. What is the gradient function? The gradient function is a function that describes the gradient at any point on the curve. Now our original function in this case is y equals x squared or if you're familiar with function no notation, y equals x squared is the same thing as uh, f of x is equal to x squared. And what we're trying to find now is f dash x. And what f dash x is going to tell us is the gradient of any point on that curve without drawing the tangent line. So let's make f of x so this is the general formula actually let me just write that down first the uh, general formula the general formula for finding the gradient function Uh, using the original function is so uh, if f of x which is our original function is equal to a which is just the coefficient of x a x to the power of n then f dash x which is our gradient function is n times a times x to the power of n minus 1. So let's try that on our curve here. So our curve here our original function is y equals x squared so let's f of, so this is our rule so let f of x 
equal x squared. Right now, remember when we have x squared, uh, a is just one. So a is one, n is two. Then f dash x. According to our formula, we're going to bring n to the front, so we're going to bring 2 to the front, times by a, which is 1, times by x, to the power of n minus 1, n is 2, minus 1 is 1. So using the formula, we've just found the gradient function to be 2x. Now, how does the gradient function help us to find the gradient? So let's say find the gradient of the curve f of x is equal to x squared at the point where x is equal to 3. Now if you use the gradient function, you'll see that f dash x is equal to 2x and all you have to do is substitute the number 3 into the gradient function so that's 2 times 3 which is 6. So the gradient at x equals 3 is 6. So let's use our um, GeoGebra tool to prove whether that's true or not. So we're going to move the point to x is equal to 3, which is about, um, let me use my arrow keys. So press control right, and you will see that when the point is that x is equal to 3, the gradient of the tangent line is 6. Right? y equals 6x minus 9. So the gradient is equal to 6. So therefore we have just found the gradient of the curve without having to draw the tangent line. So um, this process of going from f of x to f dash x, this process is called differentiation. Right? And f dash x is also named the derived function or you can call it the derivative so when someone says find the derivative of a function or differentiate a function basically what they want you to do is to find the gradient function which is f dash x okay I hope you guys learned something today uh, see you again next time